Northern Virginia a nurse is embarking on a journey to Gaza tonight on her first medical mission to help the thousands injured as Israel's war with Hamas continues. Let's get right to Fox 5. Stephanie Ramirez, she saw the nurse off and is joining us from Dulles International tonight with more on her efforts. Steph. Ladies, good evening. This mother and area mom works as an operating nurse, operating room nurse, as well as an emergency room nurse. So she's seen a lot, but she tells us she doesn't think anything can really prepare her for treating patients in a war zone. Still, this woman feels a moral obligation to act. With one personal bag and three suitcases full of medical supplies. Hi, I'm all, thank you. The 42 year old Northern Virginia nurse Eject. checked in at the United Airlines counter, focused but still anxious. I backpedaled like, like all week long, thinking maybe I shouldn't go through with this, but I'm putting my faith in God's hands and I'm hoping for the best, hoping for a ceasefire tonight um, so that the medical professionals who are there can get the job done with helping heal these victims of war. Lana, who asked we not use her last name for safety reasons, volunteered about three weeks ago with the international humanitarian nonprofit Med Global to bring her skills to the Gaza Strip. There is a team there now who shared video of what they're facing. We must warn you, those images are difficult to watch. Recent reports say Gaza's health ministry estimates the number of wounded is around 60,000. The death toll, over 25,000. Lana telling Fox 5 she was moved to act, seeing people die from injuries most heal from every day. There, they don't have the medicines that they need. They don't have the physicians they need. Um, they're getting infected and succumbing from sepsis. So it's stuff that we can help them with if we're allowed in with our medical supplies and medications. She raised over $10,000 to both ship and fly over her own medical supplies, headed to Rafah, the crossing between Egypt and the Gaza Strip. While checking in, Lana told Fox 5 it was her mother who inspired her to become a nurse. And now, of Palestinian descent, is her family taking her to that next step. For humanity's sake, I've got to go and help. And while this is a first medical mission with very personal ties, Lana tells us she plans for this to be the first of many. She wants to go all across the world to help patients, no matter their background. We certainly wish her safety on her trip, guys. We're told she's supposed to be there for about two weeks. I'll send it back to you in there.